Okay, we're here in some neighborhood. Halfway point, decided to uh, take a trip out and go see the Red Sea. And this is just a halfway point. I gotta step back on the bus here in a minute and have another hour, but just your typical Turkish town on the European side. Dropping me off. Man. There's the castle up there. I think it's closed, but. Boy, it's windy, but there it is the Black Sea. Here in the... Gonna have to come see this place before I left. It's pretty wild to think that over in that direction there's a whole war going on with Ukraine and. Russia. Back behind me where I'm going to fly at. Another war just started in Israel and Gaza and Hamas. Hamas? Whatever. But in most of the world, life is actually really peaceful and beautiful. I've been getting messages almost every day like, uh, are you alright? What's going on? Are you okay? Didn't hear from you. Yeah, man. The world is fine, everyone's fine. People just sit there and watch the news and get freaked out by everything, but go out and see that everything is fine. Well, there's a castle up there, so I'm gonna try to trek on up there. Even though I got here late, that was a crazy two hour bus ride through these mountains and, oh, just everything's incredible. So, I'm going to try to get up onto that mountain and see if I can get to that castle anyways. Well, coming up here. And I guess I'm poop out of luck. It looks like, uh, looks like this place is closed. The castle's right over there. Got a bulldozer going down. Looks like they're redoing it. They got scaffolding all around it. And uh, I think the fence goes all the way up and all the way down. So I don't think I'm going to be able to climb any of this. Eh. Uh, Got some time before sunset, so I guess I will go around and explore and see what I can get into and make the best of a good situation. All right, well, I went past the castle just to see what's further up the street. And uh, there's this incredible gorge. I don't know, I've never seen weird landform like this before. Oh shit. When the hell did you get here? Literally that dog was not standing next to me a second ago. But damn, look at that. Absolutely incredible land here. Now, up beyond that is uh, a huge mass of oil tankers and like different tankers with grain and stuff. I'm assuming they're here because this is the uh, Black Sea and literally Crimea is like right over there.
So I stepped up a little higher so you can see the kind of water line. And uh, I've got 15, 20 tankers right there. Looks like there's a restaurant up here. Should be the very top of the, yeah, the Kale restaurant. What a location. I think the last car just left. There's no one in there. In the back of the restaurant here. It's also, uh, I didn't get it on video, but there's this incredible bridge. Kind of see right there, and right there. So that's um, that goes from the because I'm right at the corner here of Hung uh, Turkey. So as far as that being the Black Sea, on that side over there, which you can see is actually the Asian side. So that's where Asia begins, and I'm right on the uh, European side. Well, my only goal today was actually to go swim in the Black Sea, but looks like it's pretty difficult to get to. It's getting pretty cold, pretty windy, getting dark soon. Maybe those are all excuses, so. Just cows walking around all of them all over the place by themselves. Been noticing that on the whole bus ride over here. Just random cows in the road. Oh, what do you want, dog? Can't you see there's cows crossing the road? Leave him alone, dog. Where are we all going? Where are we going? No. Oh. Come on, let's go. Let's find out where these cows are going. Don't try to hump me. I think the best thing about all this is that I have no idea where the hell I'm at. I don't know what town I'm in or anything. I just took a bus today because I wanted to see the Black Sea. And I wanted to swim in the Black Sea. And now look at all these friends I'm making. Huh. Well, my friend are back on this side. Climb up on the top of the mountain. Okay, you know what? Go. You ready? Come on. All right. I've been walking about ten minutes here. Now he's, he's following me. I'm following him. We're trying to get this epic sunset. All right, we're still going up. The scene is epic. Man, I've never seen such a good sunset. More cows. We're up on top of the next uh, thing here. Let's keep going. Ismail Zeging Zyga. I wonder what this place is. Alright, well, I missed the sunset kind of. There's another mountain over here, so I really wouldn't have been able to see it, but man, it is just beautiful here. I'm not sure what this place I'm at here is. Istanbul, Rummel, Faneri, Valeria. Some kind of compost, but.
It is beautiful. Well, that'll be the end of my trip here to the Black Sea. Just walking through the woods now. Call to prayer just started five seconds ago. There's a lot of these weird plants, like hexagonal. Everything here is set up to cut you. Even these plants, I've never seen things like this, but these are they're like dandelions, but it's just thick thorns everywhere. But yeah, surrounded by the Red Sea. The sun is setting over that direction. Some kind of abandoned building that looks like it was pretty popular back in the day. But yeah, at this point, gonna start walking back. Uh, there's nothing in the area except for that bus stop, like at all. So, not much else to explore, but this cool, uh, cool piece of land here. Cool how it's so different. Cool how it's so peaceful in the middle of, literally, in the middle of two wars going on right now. But here, there is peace.